Oh hey guys, morning. So straight to the point. In this video, I'm gonna tell you how to do live streaming on YouTube like a pro. live on YouTube like three times so three live streams on YouTube till now and I have got a ton of questions about how I make those live streaming on YouTube look so good so I'm going to explain you about my setup this is kind of a pro setup you need a lot of equipments but once done you are like all set so first I'm going to explain you my equipments how you need to set it up and I'm going to place all of those links below in the video description so you can just go ahead, buy it, use my video, watch it, do the setup and go live on YouTube immediately. So first of all, you need a laptop. You need a MacBook Pro or you need a Windows computer, whatever you have, good to go. You need a good audio recorder. You need at least a Zoom H5 or H6. The main job is being done by this. This is the live streaming encoder, which is connecting your camera to the computer through the software and the software name is OBS. You need this software, you need to just go ahead and download it. It's free, OBS is free. So first thing you need is a computer. Second thing is you need to install the OBS application. Third thing is you need to have a camera which has a HDMI output because this encoder has the HDMI input. So you need a cable which is connecting to the HDMI of your camera. It's coming into this. This is the cam link, this is not available in India. So in case you need this, you have to import it through my company. So I have left the link below in the video description. Just go ahead and order. Normally we get it in 30 to 35 days. We can get it shipped to you with FedEx or Blue Dot. So cam link it is. Most important thing is you cannot do live streaming in 4K because that is still a limitation and it needs a lot of bandwidth. So yeah, main thing I forgot to tell you, the main thing which you need for live streaming is a good internet connection a high fast fiber broadband or internet connection without it your live streaming are going to be oh oh e, oh all those kind of stuff you are going to see in your live stream and pretty sure you don't want your live stream to look like that so internet fiber broadband at least is maybe close to 20 or 30 mbps is a good to go speed for live streaming on youtube cam link good audio recorder good computer OBS connecting it and yeah, camera which has the HDMI input. So that is pretty much all of the equipments what you need for the complete pro setup for live streaming. Also you need a lot of dongles and cables. So if you are on a MacBook Pro like me, you need like two or three cables. You need two USB-C to USB 2.0 cable or the USB 3.0 cable. And then you need one cable to power up your audio recorder. I'm going to show that to you. Right now, actually, I'm using the Zoom H5 to, to record the audio for the same video. So basically, I cannot show that to you right now, but I'm going to show it to you in a moment, maybe. So that is all about the equipments. Now about the setup, first you need to do is open up the OBS application, connect a cable to your camera, connect that cable to this HDMI input of the cam link, connect a dongle to this connect this to your computer, open up the OBS. You are going to see a feed from the camera. Come on. So you're going to see a feed from the camera, set it up, set up the profile, name it as your camera, then set up your audio recorder. It's kind of complex. Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh. All right, for the audio, it's a kind of bit complex. So go to the audio recorder, go to the USB option. You need to have your audio recorder which has the USB option. It's only available on the Zoom H5 or Zoom H6. So I have a Zoom H5, so all you need to do is go to the Zoom H5 options, USB, go to the stereo application, uh, stereo option, go to the uh, bus powered Mac and connect it. Good to go. Your audio record is all set. Then you will be having one option for the audio. You will see your audio feed coming from the audio recorder. Your video feed is ready from the camera. Go ahead, set up the application in your OBS. Go to the preferences, set up your YouTube channel, authenticate it with your Gmail account, good to go. 
just click on start recording yeah before that you need to select or try some stuff again and again in your maybe a different youtube account or maybe a private live stream to just see if your audio and video is getting in perfect sync or not normally i move the audio by 0.2 seconds to match exactly which my voice so that is the complete setup for the live streaming with the obs cam link audio recorder and all those cables connected to the computer with a camera which has a hdmi output so that should be it if you have got any questions just let me know that is pretty much the complete setup of mine and yeah of course you need to have proper lights for the live streaming without lights your live stream is going to look absolutely crap and i know i mean i always want to make my picture a bit different something looks in good online so normally i put a small lut i've done few changes to a profile on my lightroom and i have exported it to as a lut for the live streaming so if you need i'm offering it for free the link is below in the video description you can use that lut to live stream on the obs all you have to do is just go to the obs camera profile click filters go to the lut load profile and download my lut file select it and you are going to see some nice live streaming profile right on your obs and you are all set okay a bit in detail so you need a computer obs is installed you need a camera which has a hdmi input then you need a zoom h5 you need this cable the hdmi to micro usb to connect your camera to the encoder you need this cam link encoder you need this cable to connect the g uh, i mean the zoom h5 to the computer you need those two dongles if you are on a macbook pro i'm going to show you exactly what i do so cam link gets connected to this and the hdmi cable connects to the cam link now the cam link is connected to the computer connected now this thing needs to be connected to the camera hdmi micro hdmi input so camera is connected to the cam link encoder and cam link encoder is connected to the computer now let's connect the audio part video part is done audio part is so micro usb connects to this then this dongle connects to this and we connect it for the audio part so audio recorder zoom h5 is connected to this cable this cable goes to the dongle this cable goes to the macbook pro all you need to do is this go to the zoom h5 set up the camera and the audio let's say i'm switching on the camera camera is on now the camera is connected to the obs we should see the feed right here uh i just need to select the change the menu to 1080p because cam link do not support 4k uh ha -huh. hd 1080p it's connected okay zoom h5 go to oh sorry usb audio interface stereo pc mac bus powered yes audio is connected video is connected now if i select the sony a7r3 profile is right here zoom h5 audio is right here and i can just go ahead and select or test the start streaming start recording studio mode hdmi is connected so that's the pretty much the complete setup about connecting the video part camera for the video zoom h5 for the audio to the computer audio video is set ob is connected you just have to set up the obs with your youtube profile start with the streaming get set go and about setting up the obs just open up the obs since my profile is already set you can see the live so just click on source audio input or audio output game image camera you can just select the video capture mode video capture device click on the camera for example i have said this sony a7r3 device you need to select this is my macbook pro camera and this is the cam link which is connected so cam link preset high save 
video profile is saved and this is the audio profile you can see that the zoom h5 is connected and the audio is working perfectly so all you have to do is video and audio is set go to obs preferences stream and you can get this stream key from your youtube profile go to the live streaming page on youtube and you will get the stream key click on that get the stream key click ok your youtube streaming part is done audio and video part is done now how to make this live streaming look good so my picture profile i am providing that for free it's the link is below in the video description just go to the camera profile filters effects tab apply a lot save uh, enter anything sj for example then the path profile go to my file it's selected you can see that the lot is applied so you can adjust the intensity of the lot you need this is the default camera live streaming and you if you want to style it a bit i just want to keep it something like this 0.5 so looks good Ooh, lovely so that's the complete setup about the obs camera setup what all equipments you need and how to add my lot to make the live streaming absolutely sick so you're pretty much set good to go let me know if any questions set. so if you have got any questions about it let me know in the comment section below smash the subscribe button if you haven't done it yet and don't forget to click on the bell icon to stay updated i will see you in my next video